Hello everyone, my name is Thomas Gula and I warmly welcome you to the Legal For You channel. I invite you to watch our videos. On this channel, you will discover practical tips and advice that will help you successfully run your businesses. Join us to stay up to date with the latest content and develop your legal knowledge. Enjoy watching. Today, I will discuss the topic of ChatGPT, will the European Union block its use? ChatGPT is a revolutionary tool that uses artificial intelligence to generate natural and interactive responses to users' questions. However, ChatGPT raises concerns and questions regarding data privacy and ethics like many new technologies. Mm. Italy is the first European Union country to decide to block the use of ChatGPT on its territory. The Italian Data Protection Authority has ordered OpenAI to stop processing user data arguing that the company does not have the appropriate legal basis for collecting user data to train the chatbot and language model algorithms of ChatGPT. This decision has sparked controversy, and the Deputy Prime Minister of Italy, Matteo Salvini, has stated that it is hypocritical as many other online services also collect user data but have not been blocked. Therefore, questions arise about whether this decision was appropriate and whether other EU countries will follow Italy's lead and stop using ChatGPT. It is worth noting that blocking ChatGPT is not just a matter in Italy. ChatGPT was wholly or partially banned in several countries such as China, Russia and Iran for various reasons unrelated to data collection. In Russia and Iran, blocking ChatGPT is due to concerns about the potential impact of this technology on political stability. In Iran, ChatGPT was blocked due to fears that it could be used to organize anti-government protests. Germany is also consulting with Italian regulatory authorities on the ban on ChatGPT in Italy. German Commissioner for Data Protection Ulrich Kelber stated that such action is also possible in Germany. On the other hand, many other countries, such as France and Ireland, are watching the situation regarding the blocking of ChatGPT in Italy, but have yet to take action. Although blocking ChatGPT is controversial, it is worth noting that these decisions are made to protect user data privacy and ensure security and political stability. However, it is worth noting that ChatGPT is not the only AI technology that raises concerns about data privacy and ethics. Many leaders in the technology industry, including Elon Musk, express their concerns about AI development and its potential impact on society and the economy. It is also worth noting that the United States is concerned about the open AI tool. The bot has been accused of threatening privacy, misleading, being biased, and threatening national security. The Center for AI and Digital Policy KDP, wants OpenAI to undergo independent reviews of products and services before release. On the other hand, ChatGPT is also a tool that accelerates technological development and innovation. The 123 team, a European community of startups, has appealed to the Swedish presidency of the EU Council for a less restrictive approach to AI to maintain the innovation of EU companies. The conclusion from all this is that technological development and innovation must be balanced with data privacy protection and ethics. Decisions regarding blocking new AI technologies must be made in a thoughtful and fact-based manner, not emotions or fears. Okay, what do you think about ChatGPT and its future in Europe? Is blocking its use appropriate or not? Feel free to share your opinions in the comments. Also, be sure to watch the next episodes of the Legal For You program. Thank you. Bye.